I've now put a new distributor on the Grand Marquis. I went to O'Reilly's and found out that a brand new one was only like $39.95, so rather than testing with another old one, I just went ahead and bought a new one. And it really seems to have solved the problem. The only thing I can't seem to see is, is the timing marks. Now I tried to clean it off with some uh, engine degreaser on the uh, harmonic balancer, and when I was first experimenting with it, just turning the engine over with a, a breaker bar, I could see the marks, but I've got the timing light here, and I can't seem to, I've, I've shined the timing light on it, but I can't seem to make out the marks, although it must be pretty close because it seems to be running uh, pretty good. Here's the old distributor. I don't see any uh, abnormal wear on it. Maybe a little bit of scoring here, but I'm not sure what would have caused that. It seems to start up uh, really good, and it seems to have oil pressure. It sounds good. So, but this is, now hopefully this won't be a fluke. Hopefully it won't revert back to its old troublesome self. But this is the first time since I've owned this car that it started up the way I think an engine should because the, the buses, like the Ford B700, it'll just start up with just barely a flick of the key, and this thing has always been difficult to start. So I'm not sure exactly what the failure mode was, if it was the mechanical advance or the pickup coil, but whatever it was, it seems like this had fixed it. The only thing I need to try to do is to see if I can see those timing marks so I can fine-tune the timing. I put the bolt back on it, on the clamp, and tightened it down, or tightened it down somewhat. So now I'll demonstrate the engine uh, startup. And you barely have to flick the key, and it comes on. Sounds good. Looks like it's running smoothly. Now I've got the timing light hooked up here. But, and I don't want a collision with the fan either, so I've been trying to shine it down there, but I can't seem to can't seem to see anything. Maybe it'll just take uh, cleaning off the harmonic balancer a little bit more. So this seems really good. I hope it'll continue to start up good, but I'm, I'm crossing my fingers. I think it will. But this car has been the most difficult thing to start all the time I've had it, although sometimes it's been better than others. Sometimes it's started easier than others. I didn't even have to have the choke on. I think I, I think the the use of the choke might have been kind of a crutch to get it to start when it really had a problem somehow with the distributor or the pickup coil. So the next thing I'll try to do is see if I can clean off that harmonic balancer some more and uh, set the timing. But I, it must be pretty close. I tried to line the distributor rotor and the uh, distributor body, the vacuum advance part up, I tried to line it up with some mental notes I made of how the old one was. So there's the, the distributor replacement on the Grand Marquis.